All right, high school football now. Big matchup between Florida and Ohio. Dwyer, Florida versus Glenville, Ohio. That's Nick O'Leary, number one tight end in high school football, the grandson of Jack Nicholas. He's, he's good at anything he does. I see the hands that Nick has. It's, you know, it's some of the kids that have in the family, I don't say I have those hands like the kids do. Well, I see a lot of athleticism in Nick. Here he goes right now. Oh, Nick. Speaking of that, athleticism, a very nice run there. Yeah, he made a nice run there. But, uh, you know, you watch him do it. He does anything, everything very well. All right. Nice to do that while your grandfather's being interviewed again, the great Jack Nicholas, and grandson out on the field. And there he is in the third quarter. O'Leary runs free. Got that from Jacoby Brissett, the quarterback. O'Leary runs it in. Again, number one tight end in high school football, according to ESPNU's top 150. It's 16 to 6. Dwyer of Florida. Later in the third quarter, O'Leary is back to punt. Ball goes over his head, not his fault. Glenville recovers in the end zone. Eventually, eventually, for the touchdown. Glenville cuts the lead to two. So, under four minutes to go now. Dwyer down four. Fourth and ten. Brissett looking for his tight end. Let's get to tight end. O'Leary is there. Diving catch. Very good play there on a fourth down. Watch the catch. That's spectacular. Yes, yeah, nice <laughs> Something in the jeans, I guess. Later in the drive, fourth and five from the 40. Another fourth down. Brissett rolls right. This is a high school game, by the way. Then he throws it. There's O'Leary. He grabs it for another first down. Look at this. Nine catches, 152 yards and a touchdown for the tight end in front of Jack Nicholas. His granddad. Two plays later, minute 36 to go. Brissett. Looking deep. Tommy Lee Lewis is there, but ruled out of bounds. No catch. Looked like he got in. You look on replay. The knee is down. Oh, the knee's down. In. Oh, that's a catch. Uh, but there's no replay. So Dwyer doesn't get the touchdown. Later in the drive, 32 seconds to go. First and goal. Brissett, quarterback sneak. The pile pushing him over. And they rule it inside the one. Big yeah, at some point, well, they'll just fight eventually, their kids. Next play, 20 seconds to go. Brissett again, the sneak. Does he get it? He's in. And he, no, the, it's the teammates calling the touchdown, but it looked like he got in. It did. No whistle is blown. No touchdown is called. They're looking, clock is ticking. They're running out of time. That's the game clock, eight, seven. Stop the they, clock. They didn't. They finally blow the play dead, but no timeouts. They had no time to call another play, and the game is over. Kind of a shame. Does now look like they got in one time. Looks like they got in again. He's you know, way in. Looks well from our angle. Looks like he's in. Yeah, officials didn't see it that way. Unfortunately, after they lose the heartbreaker, 26-22, that's O'Leary oh. gives the finger to someone in the crowd. An unfortunate way to end otherwise an outstanding game.